come down to the Auto Mall today to take a look at how technology is being integrated into new vehicles. To help us understand all of that, Zach Spencer from Driving Television. You want the latest cutting edge technology, Lincoln's the place to start. Let's check it out. We're sitting inside a Lincoln MKX, and we've taken a look at previously how you can upgrade your vehicle by installing that Pioneer deck. Now we're gonna take a look at a vehicle that has all of those features and more built into it. Zach, what do you get when you buy a vehicle that has all the technology built in already? Full integration into the whole vehicle's uh, system, whether it's the speakers where the stereo uh, has the phone piggyback on. A vehicle like this, Lincoln with My Lincoln Touch, is the very, very latest, the very leading edge, and it comes standard with this technology. So what you have is you have screens on either side of the speedometer that are controlled by five-way buttons on either side of the steering wheel. The one side lets you change things like vehicle settings, like how long the light stays on inside the car. Yep. The right, uh, you would look at navigation, your phone, climate, and entertainment. Mm -hmm. And in addition to that, you have voice commands. You can push the button on the steering wheel and say to the car, play Madonna. Mm -hmm. It'll find that either on your smartphone that's connected either via Bluetooth or via USB, or it's on the hard drive inside the vehicle, and it'll start playing Madonna for you. And the main controller is here in the middle a large screen, uh, you can change so many settings in there and it's upgradable. In addition to that, you've got touches on the uh, volume and the fan controls. You just brush your finger along and back and that changes settings. This is full integration. You can't get this with aftermarket systems to the level of this anyway. Yeah, this is truly amazing. I gotta say, sitting inside of this, it makes it feel like a spaceship to me, but I'm a technology guy and I love having this much control over everything from controls on the vehicle to all the entertainment. Well, now we're gonna take a look at how driver safety comes into place. We're gonna take a look at a Volvo. Well, we've come over to Volvo to take a look at some of the technology advancements in safety. And today, specifically, we're gonna look at something called city safety that's built into Volvo cars. Zach, what is that? Well, the basis of this system is active cruise control. So what you do is you set the cruise control, so if the vehicle in front slows down, your vehicle automatically slows down. If the vehicle in front accelerates, this vehicle accelerates, and it always keeps that cushion, and that makes you a safer driver, especially on the highway. That's something that I need, because I literally get on the highway and set it at 80, so I don't ever have to worry about braking. Yeah, and but then that, everybody gets way. frustrated with you <laughs> behind you, right? I do. So this is based on radar in the front. So you take the radar, which can detect the speed of vehicles, and objects in front of the car and then you add in a camera up here mm. all right now what this can do is it can detect if a vehicle has stopped and under 35 kilometers an hour the city safety is if you do not take any input into the car if you do not apply the brakes and the driver does nothing the vehicle will stop automatically all on its own now why, why do you need that like shouldn't the driver just be able to stop on their own well this is really good for people who are driving under 35 kilometers an hour they're not attentive mm -hmm. they're playing with their cell phone when they shouldn't be. They're looking at the radio. These are the times when people really aren't concentrating because it's slow speed. And you can get into fender benders, and that's what insurance companies have to pay out on. Now, the camera really comes into play with what's called pedestrian detection. So the camera can detect somebody stepping off, and it will scrub off the speed above 35 kilometers an hour below. It'll stop the car altogether. So, Zach, what's the benefit to buying this integrated into the vehicle versus as an aftermarket? Well, the number one thing, you get the automatic braking system with Volvo, the city safety, that you wouldn't get if you just had the camera notifying you that an object is in front of you. The car actually takes control of the situation and stops on your behalf. Well, there you go. That's just one look today at how you can use technology built into the vehicle integrated versus adding it afterwards and the benefits to that. Zach, thanks so much for joining us today. Now we're going to get you in a new car. What's it going to take? We'll get you some low monthly payments, easy lease financing, whatever you like. I'll take everything I've seen today.